We all love a good haul, right? Sit back and relax. Your girl got you. Get a cup of coffee, get some tea, get a snack. Let's go over some goodies. Well, first, my name is Naya, and here on my channel, I like to focus on fragrance, beauty, and lifestyle. So if that's your thing, then please subscribe to my channel, become a member of my YouTube family. Also, like and share my videos and hit the notification bell so that you're notified each time that I upload a new video. And leave me a comment below so we can get to know each other. So now, let's get right into this haul. Welcome back, guys. I'm so excited for my video today. <laughs> We all love a good haul video. We all love when we get goodies in the mail. So I am so excited to just basically show you what I got. Um, I'm not really doing a in-depth review on anything in particular. These are just some items that have been coming in the mail within the past few days and I've just been collecting them. And I said, you know what? Let me just go on here and do a haul and share with you guys what I got. So I'm so excited. So the first thing that I got that I was just so excited to try because you all know how much I love Comra, right? If you're new to my video, hey girl, hey guy, <laughs> I am a Comra lover over here. <laughs> so I absolutely love Comra. So when Comra was coming out with, let me not butcher the name, Kakwa? I said, okay, let me get it. This is supposed to have a coffee note in it and I enjoy a coffee note. So if you're telling me it's gonna have the same DNA as Kamra, but add some coffee to it, I'm here for it. So here she is, beautiful packaging, just like the original. And then when you open it, I don't wanna drop anything. But it comes like that. Ah, oh, stunning, right? I don't want to blind you with the mirror in the back. Absolutely beautiful. So then you just take it out of the little box that it's in. And then this is what you have. So it's the same bottle as the original camera, but the juice is lighter and the bottom is like an ombre so it's a little darker at the bottom here but it's absolutely gorgeous so let me just quickly tell you some of the notes that comes in kakwa if i'm saying that right <laughs> but we have cardamom ginger cinnamon praline white flowers candied fruits vanilla musk benzoin coffee and tonka beans so I will say, when I got this in the mail the other day, I was, whoo, mmm, you get that cinnamon. I was so excited to test this out. So I did wear this one day, and I'm going to say this. I've seen reviews on this, and people are really getting a, a coffee note from what I've seen people say. I am getting a very light coffee note in the opening. And I wanna say that lasts on my skin for about 10 minutes. After that, to me, the dry down is just very similar to the original Comra. I was expecting the Comra DNA, and that's exactly what I got. But I also was expecting a strong coffee note. It's not a strong coffee note, not to my nose. Um, am I mad that I have it? No, because I enjoy Kamra. So do you need this if you already have Kamra? I don't know. I would say if you are a collector and you just want to have it, I would say go ahead and grab it um, because, you know, it is an expensive. It's not like you're paying two or three hundred dollars for this bottle. This is an inexpensive fragrance. Um, but do you need it? I would say no, only because to me, in my opinion, this is like having a second bottle of Kamra, which I'm not mad at because I love Kamra. So now I can kind of just go through my Kamra and just, you know, wear it whenever I want to and know that I have this when I'm done with that. Between this one and Kamra, 
I would say get camera. Get camera. Only because you're probably getting this because you're expecting to have that coffee note. And to my nose, it's very, very light. And that coffee note does not last long. But I'm glad that I have it. I will wear it. I enjoy it. It does have that original Karma DNA. So if you enjoy that, then get it. Try it. Test it out. See what you think. I don't think you'll be disappointed with it unless you're really expecting a strong coffee note. That's the only thing I can see. But you may get yours and you may smell that coffee. Maybe mine needs to sit for a little while. Who knows? You know how these Middle Eastern fragrances go. So this may need to sit, but I'm glad that I have it. I will be wearing it. So this is definitely, you know, an item that I'm happy that I got. So the next items, oh, I'm just looking over here at everything. <laughs> Guys, I need to be stop I need to be stopped but listen this is what I enjoy I love fragrance I love body oils I love all of that so guys the next items on my list are from Dawkins and I have fallen in love with Dawkins look at that packaging it's just so beautiful so nice and sleek and just classy right so I love their body oils. I've already have Coco Cashmere, which I enjoy that one. I have Bananas Brulee, which I absolutely love. And I layer that with anything that I want to add that banana sweetness to. And so I went on their website. I think they had a sale recently going on. And I was like, okay, let me try this out. I think it was Black Friday. I think that's when I got all of this stuff. And so I definitely said I want to get more of their body oils because I think they're just amazing, right? So I started out with Angel's Elixir. And so, of course, this is their interpretation of Angel Share um, by Killian. And I just thought this would be great just to add like that cinnamon and just a little slight booziness to any fragrance absolutely gorgeous right so first let's look at the packaging here this is beautiful this is just top tier this is elegant and you get the glass bottle it comes with a nice dropper and so with this you can drop this in your unscented lotions you can just drop it in your hand rub it in and rub it all on your body that's normally what i do with my body oils I don't waste time putting them in lotions. <laughs> I just like to get the full effect. So I just put it directly on my skin and just rub it in. So I love this one. So this is Angel's Elixir, another body oil that I got. So they come in the little box here. So let's see what this one is. This one is twice baked. And this is supposed to be Zhirzhov's, um, uh, I'm not going to lie because I can't remember, <laughs> but this is supposed to be a scent by Zhirzhov. This is supposed to be their interpretation. And this one, mm, absolutely beautiful. This is a gourmand scent. It's sweet. It has that vanilla in it. It almost smells like, like a type of a pastry. Absolutely beautiful. So I got twice baked. And then the last oil that I got, I know this is their interpretation of Zhirzhov's um, Lyra. And I have a decant of Lyra. I like Lyra. Um, so I said, let me get the body oil. This is called Caramel Glacé. Beautiful bottle, right? This is just, mmm, you get that bergamot. Oh, this is nice. It smells like there's caramel in there. You definitely get that citrus off the top. It smells like lira which is supposed to be like a lemon pound cake so it smells like a lemon dessert ah oh, absolutely beautiful so those are the body oils that i got from dawkins 
and then the last item I got from Dawkins was a perfume and so it comes in this nice box here and this is supposed to be their uh, take on Montal's chocolate greedy and so I've always had chocolate greedy on my list to at least get a decant and try but just never really got around to it. But when I saw this on their website, cute little bottle, this is the 1.7 ounce perfume. And I said, let me go ahead and try it, right? Oh, guys, this is beautiful. I'm getting straight chocolate just off of the nozzle here. Oh, I can't wait to wear that one. So. I'm going to give you updates on everything. I just basically want to show you what I got today, but I'm excited to try this. So this is called Chocoholic. Did I even tell you the name? <laughs> this is Chocoholic by Dawkins. And this is their interpretation of Montal's Chocolate Greedy. Okay, so next up guys in this haul, you know that I love body oils, right? So, you know that House Urban is quickly becoming one of my favorite websites to purchase body oils. So I got their mini trio kit and this is their glaze dry body oils. I'm gonna try to hold them all up. <laughs> but it comes in a set of three. So cute, right? And I don't know if you've watched my last um, House Urban video that I did, but I go through these. I love, love their body oils. I put these all over my body. So when they came out with this set, this is called the um, House Brew. I believe the name of this trio is called. And it comes with Coco Chanel is one of the scents, which is a hot chocolate and peppermint. So, so nice for the holidays, right? Oh, and you get that mint and you get the chocolate. A literal gourmand scent, right? I can't wait to try this out. What would I wear this with? Hmm, I would have to see. I may try this with Chocolate Queen by Navitas just to kind of really amp that chocolate up or maybe um, Choco Musk by Al Rehab. Mm-hmm. That's, that's what that was going to be for. <laughs> and so this next one is called Not So Basic. And this is your pumpkin spice latte. Really nice, right? Ooh. You get that pumpkin. You get the cinnamon. You get all those fall spices, the nutmeg. Oh my gosh, whoo, yeah, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. I like this one. This is absolutely beautiful. I could see layering this with mm, the cologne of Ginger Biscuit by Dua. That's a dupe of Joe Malone's Ginger Biscuit. Oh, I think that would play so nicely with this. I can't wait to wear that one. So that one's called Not So Basic. And so the third one in this trio is called Pick Me. And this is Caramel Apple Cider. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. You get that caramel in there. And you get that apple. This smells like a caramel apple, like the candy that you get. Oh my gosh, yeah. Mmm, literal gourmand scent also. And this would pair nicely with Kamra. Yeah, this would pair nicely with Kamra or either the new one that I got, Kakwa. I think that's how you say it, girl. <laughs> <laughs> but this would pair nicely with karma it would really amp up that apple and really amp up that caramel this is beautiful okay so that is what i got from house 
urban. So guys, the last few items that I have are from Oil Perfumery. And I mentioned in a video a while ago that I really, really needed to do a video on my collection of Oil Perfumery because I already have um, Fev, I have Vanilla Diorama, I have Spirituese Doubly Vanille, and I have Murin Tonka. I absolutely love, love these roller balls. So they're just small, cute little roller balls. You can put them directly on your skin. You can add them to your unscented lotion. I put them directly on my skin and just rub them in and I use it as a layering base. Absolutely love these, right? So I got four more <laughs> to add to my collection. And so I have their impression of YSL Baby Cat. Oh, when I saw that they had Baby Cat, I was like, yes, yes, I'm getting this, right? And when I tell you guys, it is spot on. They do a really good job with, you know, remaking these or recreating these. It's absolutely beautiful. That is baby cat. That's baby cat. So if you are having a hard time finding baby cat, or if you just don't want to spend that money on baby cat and you want to just, you know, test it out just to see if it's something that you would enjoy, Try this from Oil Perfumery. I own Baby Cat. So in my opinion, this is spot on for it, right? And so then the next one that I have is their impression of Grand Soir by MFK. And this one, I have to say, it's nice. To me, this is a little cologne <laughs> if that's a word. It leans a little more masculine to me. And I do have a decant of Grand Soir. So I would have to actually pull that out and, and smell that and see if this is kind of giving the same thing. I believe that it is. But this one just leans a little masculine in my opinion. But, you know, I will test this out and try it and then maybe, you know, just use it as a layering base but top it with something sweeter. So that may be an option. Or give it to my boyfriend. <laughs> so another one that I have is Nutmeg and Ginger, and this is their Joe Malone impression. And I actually wore this one the other day with Dua's the Cologne of Ginger Biscuit, which is their interpretation of Ginger Biscuit by Joe Malone. So I figured, okay, let's layer these two and just really see what it's giving. Oh, it's hard. <laughs> this ginger in here is just so sweet and soft and bright. I feel like there has to be some bergamot in here. I'm getting like a bright citrus note as well, but this is absolutely beautiful. And like I said, I layered these two together, this and the perfume, and it was just uh, absolutely beautiful. So then the last one I got in this haul is going to be Princess. And this is of course their impression of Princess by Killian. And I have a decant of Princess spot on oh you get that green tea and that marshmallow note absolutely beautiful oh I want to put this on now <laughs> absolutely gorgeous guys so if you haven't already tried oil perfumery I would really highly highly suggest going onto their website just to see if anything piques your interest I can guarantee that something will and the prices are phenomenal. I mean, very reasonable and stuff like this. This is going to last you a long time. You know, you're not going to run through one of these very quickly. So I just kind of feel like it's worth it. It's worth trying out just to see if you enjoy it. So far, what I've received, I have about nine of them now. And I want to say they're all spot on for the original. So I enjoy it. So I had to add these to my haul video, my oil perfumery. 
<laughs> well guys that's the end of my video thank you so much for taking some time to chill with me today i hope you enjoyed this haul a bit of a decent size haul i have some more items coming in the mail so i will definitely do a part two i hope that you enjoyed it i hope that you come back subscribe to my channel become a member of my youtube family also like and share my videos and hit the notification bell so that you're notified each time when i upload a new video and leave me a comment below because i know we're all shopping i know that we all have items on our wish list so leave me a comment and let me know if you've tried any of these or if you plan to and until the next time guys bye